back here at Hershen Ashton. Uh, working our way towards playoffs. But first, we have an FA Trophy game against Dartford today. Um, so we're going to do that. That's going to be the first thing on today's agenda. And then uh, we're going to make our push for the playoffs. Because, as you will see, we are in fourth place. Uh, just three points off of third, five points off of second. Probably not making up the eight points with the, that were behind Knotts County with um, 14 games to play. Probably not making up those eight points. But I feel pretty good about us making up three points or five points. Then I guess if we make up three points or five points, then really we're just one win off making up eight points. But we'll see how it goes. We got some good games coming up on the schedule uh, after our game against Dartford. Uh, we play Maidenhead, who are in 19th, Kingsland, who are in 14th. Then this is where the stretch, the we South End, who are in 6th, uh, Wealdstone. I, I don't want to talk about Wealdstone. Um, Knotts County, who are in 1st, and then Wrexham, who are right there with us in 5th. So we got kind of a mix here. We got some bottom of the table teams, but then we've got uh, some other teams, three, te three games against teams that are also in playoff contention. Thankfully, the three games against the playoff contenders, including Knotts County, the leaders, are all at home. Uh, so that makes things... Uh, I think I've, that makes me feel pretty confident going into those games, having the, the three three home games coming up are against playoff contenders. And then, of course, we have to travel to some teams that are towards the bottom of the table. But again, I feel pretty confident about our chances against them. Really well. So this uh, is going to be very interesting to see... Um, how we do against them because like I said they haven't lost since October 29th I think it was so hopefully this is a good game so yeah we've got Chris Renshaw, uh, McLaughlin, Maxim Kogan, Roberto Lopez, Adam Blakeman, James Ball, Jack McKay, Liam Coyle, Dakari Sheriff, Adam Thomas, Dominic Knowles, and then on the bench, Daniel Jurovich, Harry Flowers, Billy Drew, Luke Molyneux, and Bradley Rolt. They are also rotating some for this game as well. That's good to see. Uh, let's go out and play for the media. Most of them like it. Okay. set this back to key. I keep going back and forth if I want that on extended highlights or key highlights but I think we're going to just play the key highlights um, just to go a little bit quicker and try and get through some more of these games here. Right, well they are definitely showing some nice patience with their passing here. Oh. Struggling in the rain here a little bit to put the pressure on them that I need to put on them to have them make a mistake. And they got behind the defense. Oh, good tackle there, Blakeman. Great tackle. Forced that out for a corner. Good recovery after getting beat down the sideline there. Uh, oh, it was steam did not come back on side quickly. Now I have three shots there. All on target. There we go. That's what we're looking to do. Put some pressure on their back line. Force them into a long ball that we can win. Ball. Oh, good pass out there to Thomas. Look for McKay on the header. Oh. Off the top. We're having a hard time getting possession from them because they just... Ooh, Blakeman almost had a spectacular goal there. They're playing with their, their flat 4-5-1 and just passing the ball around back here. So we're having a hard time getting the ball back from them. A little bit here. Oh, wait, maybe we're going to wait for this highlight to finish. Okay, nice work, Thomas, getting to that second ball. Oh, oh, straight at the keeper. All right, let's change up what we're doing a little bit here. 
because put trying to put pressure on them is not working so let's try to sit back a little bit deeper ourselves and see if we can't hold the possession and maybe get them to come out and chase a little bit oh there's a great pass from coil to sheriff but again good save we're just not finishing I mean, you can't just let him turn you like that. Come on, there you go. Nice interception, Thomas. Coyle looking up ahead for Rolt. He's through behind the defense. There's the finish we needed. Let's go. Bradley, Liam Coyle and Bradley Rolt to the rescue. Also, Adam Thomas. Great job. Great interception, and then Coyle. Immediately looking up ahead for the run of roll. He's able to split their defenders. And then a very nice finish at the end. Uh, played since the 21st minute with the yellow card in it, which is fine. Uh, save that, Renshaw. Oh, no. It won't count. Oh, my goodness. Thank goodness. Oh, he was offside. Whoa. Interesting. All right, so that puts us through the FA Trophy quarterfinal. Um, let's see, who got knocked out here? Gateshead with a win. Wheelstone with a draw, so they're going to be going to a, uh, a replay. FC United's got a replay. Kettering, Maidenhead... Solihull, Moore is all getting through. Warrington getting through. Beating Wrexham. So, again, we're going with our uh, tweak to the wingers here. Changing them from inside forwards to inverted wingers. Uh, so they'll look to... They won't be so adverse to crossing. And they'll also take a little bit fewer risks while still cutting in and passing or shooting. Hey, got back here just in time. Well done. James Ball to Liam Coyle. Off to a great start. Great, great start there. James Ball. His free kick finds its way through to Liam Coyle, who taps it home nicely. It's a great first time finish there. Build something up from the back here. Quickly working the ball up through our midfield. Coyle ahead to Thomas, making his run inside. Back to Coyle. Ball. Thomas just patiently working our... Okay, Coyle. That was a very poor pass from Liam Coyle. That's extremely frustrating. We were doing a nice job of kind of working our, working our way up through their team there. I mean, we got back and cut them off there nicely. Still not in a terrible... Oh, we got beat on the give and go. Yep. Saw that one coming. The center back stepped up to close down. Uh, who was that? Lopez got beat there. Yeah, he stepped up to close down No Williams. Who, as soon as he made that pass ahead... Knew Lopez was out of position behind him and turned and sprinted right past him. Yeah, that was well done. All right, again, we're going to try and build up something for the back here as they are pressing quite high. Nice hustle getting to that second ball there. Playing the ball up towards Rhett. That works. If you're going to play the ball to Bradley Roll, oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh. Bradley. I've been talking so much about how good he's been doing, too. Oh.
Wow. There is no excuse for not winning this game. None. Absolutely zero excuse for not winning this game. I am furious. Wheelstone still lost. They still have one point from 34 matches. Yeah, everybody else around us won. Ay, 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 ay. As uh, Afeet and Kogan are just a little bit too tired to play in this one. Which is fine, because I want them at full strength for our next one. Anyways. So yeah, I'm okay that we rotated quite a bit for this. It's tough when you get two days off and you can't even put a rest or a recovery in there. They're just, because we're semi-professional, they're just unavailable. Oh, nice job, ball. Way to win that in the midfield. Lopez, Flowers... Ball, Lopez, Billy Drew, Kieran. Dude, you got to see the guy on the left making that run. Okay, McKay, nice job bringing that down. Though. Oh, great way to set up Molyneux. Jack McKay, great pass. Setting up Luke Molyneux there. Threw on goal. Kieran with a great pass up to McKay. And then the yeah, their keeper is just having quite the nightmare there. Well, we're in control early again. Let's see if we can hold on to it this time. Flowers, you can't do that. Rolt is never winning that ball. Poor shot. Savage was in a good position. Some patient play there from them. Their center back Rice making a nice run into our midfield. Cover that. Good job, Flowers. Way to be in the right position. Oh, Drew, you're a better passer than that, dude. side of the defender. Is he offside? No, he is not. Too many runners for us to keep track of. Yeah, Barrett was able... The, both the center backs were over marking the striker and that allowed Barrett to make a... put a wide... Uh, wide gap... Right there, Flowers leaves position to come over here for some reason. I don't know why. Like, Lopez was in a good position there. And so that left too much space for McLaughlin to cover. And Barrett was able to make an angle to run in this way. Um, got the wrong side of McLaughlin. And Flowers wasn't there to cover for it for some reason. Because he felt he needed to go close down the striker, I guess. So we had to make two changes there at halftime. Oh, good. Good pass there to Molyneux. Cross. Not that great. Koya. Oh, get to that roll. Finish it. At least this one was on target. As opposed to the one that he just unbelievably blew. Oh, Harry Flowers. Making up for the mistake. Went in the header on the corner. In off the underside of the bar. Well done, Harry Flowers. Great corner by Blakeman. Flowers is in the right position to make the uh, make the run and attack the near post. Got to defend another corner. Oh, Lopez is there. Nice work. Thank you. I thought that looked like they were in. Oh, yeah, they were. 
Okay, they were a mile offside. Jeez. It's like, how is our defense coming out of that corner so bad? Well, that would be why. They were six feet offside. Oh, nice interception, McKay. Great pressure. Plays in Sheriff on his left foot. Oh, and it's wide. On his strong left foot. Teed up nicely. Oh, nice job, Drew. Winning a header in the midfield. Over the top for roll. Oh, Rice beats him to it. Clears it. Come on. We're like 30 seconds away here from a nice road win against a solid mid-table team. Yeah, waste of time. That's okay. That was 15 seconds he took off the clock. Nice job. Coyle's never win in headers. That's not a thing that he does. Where is Blakeman? There's Blakeman finally back into position. And that's it. Woo! Okay. I will take that. This is a solid mid-table side. And we went on the road and got a victory. I will take it. I had to have it too. If I was gonna, if I'm gonna stay in touch with these top three, and I still sort of am. Uh, the draw last time obviously hurt us. I'd love to be on 67 points instead of 65 points. Uh, definitely did not take advantage of the points. Some of the points that were dropped there ahead of us. Well, seeing as how I can barely keep my eyes open here, and I'm about to fall asleep and fall over out of my chair. I think it'd probably be best if I wrap things up here. Um, but you can always find me on uh, highlights on YouTube and uh, channel updates and other stuff on Twitter. Those links are in the bio. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a good night. I'll see you next time.